right, we we are back at KFC trying these Nashville chicken hot tenders. I've seen them all over TikTok. I tried them once before. I didn't think they were that good, but we're back here. Um, yes, can I have the three piece Nashville hot tenders combo? Unfortunately, we don't have a Nashville hot sauce, but we can do buffalo or uh, barbecue. Um, I guess I will try. Ah, uh, you know what? That's okay. I'll just, I'll just skip it. <laughs> Sorry about that. No, it's okay. Thank you. super awkward. I drove really far to get here. Oh, it's so awkward. <laughs> I have to get in though. This is the TikTok one. I was going to try and cheat, but let me just not try and cheat. Oh man, I got to find another KFC. Oh, and I have to like pee really bad. And I drove 20 minutes from my house because there's one close to my house, but it doesn't have a drive through. We are now going to KFC number two. They have a drive through. This is a good sign. Okay, so that one didn't have a drive through so we're... Oh, what is this focusing on? We're going through again. Oh, there's a sign. Oh my god, is there a sign for real? If there's a sign, I'm giving up. I've went to like literally four of these today. Like, and two of them did not have drive throughs <gasps> They're currently out of natural size. Oh my gosh. Hi, you guys are out of Nashville sauce? Yes. Okay, thank you. Oh my god. Oh. Wow. Okay, this is this is just not it today. This is just not it. It's just not happening. This is the fourth one I've been to. I'm so confused. Okay. This is like the sixth one I've gone to and the line is crowded, so we're we're looking good. This truck is honking, but there's like a lot. I literally don't know what to do. I'm getting honked at. There's like a line and I don't know what to do. Just how it is. I don't know. Is this girl gonna fight? Someone's coming up to my thing. I'm going through the drive-thru. I'm going through the drive thru. You can block the street. Okay, I, I don't know what else you want me to do. I'm going through the drive thru. I already circled around. Okay, I, I'm going to try. She went to the hospital. Well, oh my god. If you're going to the hospital, oh my god, sorry. Oh god. Okay, these things are like so not even worth it. Nashville not available. Oh my god, okay, it's not even available, y'all. Ah! Okay, get out, get out, get out. Oh my god. I'm like in, like, oh my god, this is. Ah, I'm stressed and they don't even have it. I'm so, I'm literally so over these. I just want to go home and cry. Damn. I'm so, uh, uh, I just want to, okay, I'm, uh. All right, let's see here. Here's the final, final one for real. And then I'm really just giving up because I just, I don't know what else to do at this point. All right, so this is the final one for real. And then I'm getting chicken skins and calling it a day. I'm, <laughs> Carly Bell, a little bit. Pregnant Carly Bell, not Carly Bell. I look like a pregnant Carly Bell, just so people don't be like, Carly Bell's skinny. Okay. No. 
Oh man. Damn, they're out everywhere. Dang. Original recipe chicken breasts. Okay, anything else? Um, can I also get a small mashed potatoes with no gravy? Small mashed, no gravy? Yeah. Okay. Can I also, yeah, and can I also get a small corn? Sure. And a small french fry? And a mount, the orange Mountain Dew? Medium or large? Medium. Anything else? And do you have cookies? Yeah, we have three for a dollar twenty-nine. Okay, I'll do that. Anything else? And you're out of the Nashville sauce? Yes. Okay, that's it. Okay. Okay. How are you supposed to pay on this side? It's on the side of the window. Damn, they were literally sold out everywhere. I mean, we're six feet apart. It's pleasing our mask at the drive-thru, but damn, we're so far apart. This is crazy. I want to sit there. Hi. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thanks. Oh, did you get the drink as well? It was a Mountain Dew. Was it on there or no? It was a Mountain Dew, the orange one. Thank you very much. Have a good one. You too. All right. Oh my god, I spent the majority of my day literally just driving around. Oh my god, I'm so annoyed. I'm so annoyed. I didn't even get anything that I that I really wanted. Oh my god, I'm so hungry. I am so far from home. Man. Man. I tried, y'all. I was literally at 3 o'clock. Um. Damn. Eat my fries and chicken. <laughs> How y'all doing? Okay. Sorry about the little stress. If I feel a little stress, I am a little stress. Uh, just you know. So, anyways. <laughs> I drove around. But I drove around for three and a half hours today. I went to literally nine KFCs. Like three of them didn't have drive throughs <laughs> To try these Nashville hot chicken tenders that have, have been on the freaking menu for so long. Like, I remember not liking them because I think they come with pickles and I'm like. I just hate wasting my waste my time. And I a thousand percent waste my time. And I had like stuff I could have been doing. I'm glam, I could have been TikToking.
wasting time is this? Not it. Is this cute? This is Fashion Nova. <laughs> Not sponsored. But, um, I love it so much. <laughs> it's so cute. It reminds me of King Cup. Which is why I like it. I'm so sad about these chicken tenders. This Mountain Dew orange is like. That really is it. So good. Damn, did they forget the cookies? <gasps> they legit. Did they even get the cookies? Damn. They forgot. Every time I go there, they forget the cookies. It's like God's way of being like, don't eat them. You don't need them. <laughs> I'm back in the belt. Oh my God, look at all the chicken. KSC is just the skins. Take two. These are just <laughs> my favorite thing. I'm trying to get like a cute picture, but it's just really, it's just really not cute. <laughs> I don't know. Like holding dead animals are just like not a cute thumbnail. Oh my god. This is so sketchy. I'm at a bus, I'm at like this bus stop and people are. Should I be moving? Oh my, he's literally just staring at me. The move was not just being here. Why are sketchy people so sketchy? He just downed a 40. Mm -mm. This was not the cute, enjoyable meal that I had hoped for. Mm -mm. I'm trying to think what's new in the news. What's been happening? drawing a blank I've been in the recording studio like doing my music for Sabwim and when I'm in that zone like I'm there for like eight hours a day like that's all I think about like when I wake up I watch TikTok and then like I'll think about that recording studio session that day and then when I leave I just think about dinner dinner really check Twitter or anything because I'm so full I'm just like so like by the time I'm done I'm so tired I'm also like super energetic when I'm done in front of the studio because it's like oh I just did something so cool I love it I just saw Gerard Way do a podcast interview in 2021 it's with the lead actor from Umbrella Academy So I thought they'd like only be talking about Umbrella Academy, which would be cool. But they talked a lot about MCR and their music production. It was a good interview. I haven't seen Gerard Way since 2019. Like in interviews, he's such a... You can tell he's just such a kind soul, the way, the way he does interviews and stuff like that. He's just so... Oh, I just love his like energy. I just love the way what he puts off. You know, he's just so kind. He just seems so humble. Okay, you know, he was getting hyped up about his music, which he should. I did the things. Yeah, that was you know, it was a really fun album. He was so sweet. And a lot of people have been asking me like, did you know that it was Joe Rogan's cousin? Yes, I did know that. But I don't think they would. They did, they've never met, according to what I saw on Joe Rogan. Because Kevin Smith was on. He's like, you should have Gerard Way on. You guys are cousins. That's so cool. And Joe Rogan didn't seem like all that interested. 
about it he's like yeah we never met <laughs> i just feel like they're so different for what they stand for and their views and stuff like that gerard way is a god and joe rogan is trash from what i've heard on twitter he's just trash so how uh, those who are related is beyond me damn you guys while this kfc chicken skin was was delicious and enjoyable i think i get some of my hair um you know i really wish it was this chicken the buffalo or the natural hot how does tiktok make everything like that sell out like what i spent my whole day doing that what a load No cookies. She did give me a, a drink. I don't think I don't think they understood. I said I wanted three for her. <laughs> yeah, though when you're like fat, chubby, have a little bit of a weight issue, whatever you want to call me. Like I, I feel so guilty like asking for food. Like if like you know like okay like if I go out to eat, let's say I go out for breakfast, right? Um. I'm like, okay, I'm going to get eggs, bacon, pancakes, and, um, I'm like, where is it? Eggs, bacon, pancakes, like, and french toast or something, right? Or, and a side of french fries, something, like, random. And they don't bring out the french fries. I'll just, like, it's fine. It's fine. My mom will be like, oh, they didn't bring your french fries. I'll be like, it's fine. I don't eat the french fries. Like, how, you know, is anyone else like that? If you, if you're, if you think you... I don't know. Do you think you're like fat? Do you, are you that person or will you ask for the food? Honestly, I admire people who will ask for food. But I'm just like thinking like, oh, they're going to look at me and be like, really? We're trying to save you. You don't need those extra fries. You know, I don't know. Which is why I would never go back and ask for the cookies. It may not be on the thing. I don't know. But I love corn and mashed potatoes so much. And then, you know, it just wasn't an enjoyable lunch. I'm just, I'm going to be real. I didn't enjoy it. I was hungry. I needed it. But it wasn't all that enjoyable. I've just been. I started off by having to pee so bad, and I went to one 18 minutes away from me, thinking like I got pee, and I still haven't peed since. And still, here we are. Do I have chicken in my ear? I don't know. We're supposed to go on a cute date tonight too. That'll make me feel better. We're supposed to have a cute little date night. Oh, anyway, the interview with Dreadway was really good. Oh, should I? Let me... I'll tell you. I don't even want to look at my phone. My phone's been stressing me out today. Okay. Um, it was under. See, I knew there was gonna be more stuff that I didn't want to even go on. A conversation with Gerard Way and the channel is Aiden Gallagher. So I'll link it below. There's like five parts to it. I guess it was like a month ago. It was a really good interview. If you love Gerard Way, Umbrella Academy, MCR. He was like really, the kid with that interview was like really knowledgeable with music and guitar tones and structures of a song. When people get all technical like that, I really admire it. I'm like, wow, that's really cool. But I'm just one of the... Oh, my God. You know what made me so mad the other day? I'm going to be done with this because i got to call someone back off. Oh, you know what I mean? I just kind of, like, enjoy this. I wasn't just, like, in a in good vibe. I'm usually in good vibes lately. Today was just, like, not a good vibe. I just got to stress myself out. But I was watching something, and this guy was like, yeah, I'm, like, pretty... I'm pretty moderate emo. Like, I know more than just my chemical romance. I'm like... Why do people gotta diss other people? Like, oh yeah, I'm like cooler than most people because I know, I know other alternative bands. Go for you. My chemical romance are the best, so as far as I'm concerned, they're the only band that matters. <laughs> you are funny. All right. 
That's just cute or whatever. I was just like, I'm so far from home. I miss Moses. 5,000 people texting me all stuff. I don't want to answer, but it's like, mm. Anyways. I wish I had a donut right now. I love you guys so much. I'm going to like put on music and just chill when I go home. I ate the lunch. I did not get my Nashville chicken hot tenders, which is what I set out to do. That was going to be such a good TikTok, the crunch. It just didn't work today, guys. It didn't work. And that's okay. All right. I love you guys. Thanks for having lunch with me. I hope I didn't stress you out. I'm just trying to do positive vibes. Today was not the most positive vibe, but we're going to get it back. All right. I love you. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys.